welcome back to my world. No matter how old you get, you never need to grow up. And I would like to say a huge thank you, huge thank you to UCC Distributing. I miss these guys so much. We used to see them every year at Toy Fair and it, I haven't seen them in over two years. Awesome, awesome, awesome company. You're like, who are they? Like, you know all those blind bags and blind boxes you get? UCC Distributing, 9 out of 10 times. So they sent me a package because they want to introduce a new collectible which, thanks to TikTok, is already exploding off the shelves. But before I show that to you, although it is in the title of the video, I do want to show you some other goodies that they sent me because they love me. I'm very excited. Okay, so they also happen to be the makers of some exclusive Squishmallows. This is a toucan. I love Squishmallows. I love them so much. I do. Oh, they're so squishy. And unfortunately, Caden is going to steal these from me. I was like, dude, do not touch the Squishmallows in that box until I make my video. And it's been like, I was sick all week. And he was like, no Squishmallows video yet? I was like, no, dude, just patience. Patience is a virtue. So what is your name? My name is Tito. So this is Tito. And, okay, wait, I need to try to read about Tito here. Tito is known for being quiet, but when he has something funny to say, all his friends crack up. Tito wants to be a counselor when he grows up to help kids. Okay, so... It's really cute. What's really cute about Squishmallows is these characters actually have little backstories. So Tito apparently likes to crack jokes, but when he grows up, he wants to be a counselor. He wants to help people. I'm keeping Tito because Tito and I share a dream. You're like, you want to be a counselor? It's probably never going to happen because I'll never be well enough to go to school full time and all that. So instead, I make YouTube videos and try to help people and I make videos about dolls and stuff. But <coughs> Tito, Tito, honey, I feel you. I feel you, bird. It would have been weird to say I feel you, dog, right? I mean, it's a toucan. Okay, so that's Tito. <coughs> okay, wait. <laughs> Reaching, reaching. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at how lime green. Oh my gosh. This is so cute. Your name is Sunny. Of course my name is Sunny because I'm a buzz, 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 buzz. Look at the little crown. Look at Sunny's little crown. Do you see how like beautifully neon Sunny is? So Sunny, whoop. So Sunny uh, is all about the weather. So the name is a perfect, is an apt little name. Look at these little wings, they're so cute. And when Sunny grows up, Sunny wants to be a meteorologist. And it's funny because my son pointed out something really, really, you squish Sunny down and it poof, um, about how like normal the aspirations of Squishmallows are. They're not all like, I want to be a pop star. I want to be a rocket scientist. Like, I want to be a meteorologist. I want to be a counselor. You know, it's like, they're so real. And I think that's also just one tiny part of the appeal. Really, it's the squishiness and the, I mean, the, 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 the plush on Squishmallows is so, I mean, there's a whole just sensory, like, I, you know, you just sit there, you're having a bad day, you just hug your Squishmallow, and you just do this, and everything is okay again, you know? That's why everybody loves them a good Squishmallow. Okay, and now last, but absolutely not least, and these are exclusives uh, to UCC Distributing. Um, this is Andrew. Andrew. Look at Andrew. Andrew. Andrew's a deer. <laughs> it's so soft. Oh my gosh. Look how cute you are. Little white tail. Are you a little white tailed deer? Uh, I guess so. Sure. That sounds like a thing I could be. Look at the ears. <laughs> and the little floppy antlers. <laughs> You got baby antlers. Uh, it's my first year. Okay. All right. So let me see what, what is, what is the story here? So Andrew is actually not a white tailed deer. 
Andrew is a jackalope. Yes, it's a real thing. Look it up. Andrew is a jackalope. And Andrew, well, Andrew doesn't necessarily have an aspiration in life yet, but Andrew loves music, loves going to concert, loves streaming his favorite tunes. And who knows, maybe, you know, one day he'll be in the music industry. But I want you to see that Andrew has both, you know, the regular Squishmallows plush, but then on Andrew's belly, there's like a more plush plush. <laughs> Andrew's got a belly like mine. It's a little more plush than the rest of him. <laughs> oh, you're so cute. So thank you so much for these. Thank you so much. Let me put you down here, Andrew. And let me move Tito. And I'm so taking Tito and hiding him from Caden. Okay, are you ready to meet tsunamis? Like, what the heck is a tsunami? Tsunamis are just blowing up everywhere. And they are kind of like a snow globe meets cuteness. All right, so are you ready to meet tsunamis? Tsunamis, you've probably already seen them on TikTok. This is series one, and you can get them, if you can find them, at Five Below and other places that you get blind bags for your kids. And if your kids are begging you for these, and you're like, and, and these, there's so there's two kinds. There's these, there's the egg ones that are not blind bags, you know what you're getting, and they you'll see them like on a shelf, like in a, in a little, little egg carton like this. Um, and so you know what you're getting. And then there's also the prize baggy blind tsunamis that I'll show you in a second. What the heck is a tsunamis? Okay, here's the thing. When you get these for your kids, you're going to want them for yourself. Let me show you. So this is what they look like. You're like, okay, so it's a clear egg with stuff in it. Let me take off the wrapper though, so you can really see this at work. Cause, cause I wasn't even sure, like I saw them in videos and then I was like, oh, I was like, yeah, send them to me. I want to check them out. And then I was like, I must have all of them. Um, and it's like, I haven't collected little collectibles in so long. Okay, shake them up and watch them spin is the tagline. So this one is, uh, it's, and this, it's gonna be hard for the camera to like scooch around, there you go. It's a little pink kitty cat floating along peacefully in a clear egg with some black stuff, but then you, whoa! it becomes a tsunami. <laughs> it's like a snow globe. But the way that the little figures are weighted, they always end up landing right side up in here. Zoom, 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 zoom. And I could just see me sitting on calls just playing with this. So that's the black. Okay, so there are 10 tsunamis characters, but they're in different, I guess there's one, two, three, four. Four times four. There's 16 different egg varieties. So there's like different colors and the character in different colors and everything. So that first one we saw was the cute little kitty cat. This is adorable. This is, come on, face the camera. It's very hard to get them to face the camera. This is, it's a unicorn sitting on a crescent moon. And look at the color that it's in. So I'm going to try to like just sort of make it a circular whoa and of course then you can just really just shake it up and and doesn't it feel like like this is what life has been like for the past two years it just feels like someone's out there going like this and then we're like whoa, 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 whoa. okay i'm floating i'm okay i'm okay these are so so cute this one is a puppy dog are you a puppy dog i'm a puppy dog this is a face the camera, work with me, work with me, work with me. This is a puppy dog in orange. Whoa. Uh -oh. And the figures are just so cute. This is definitely like a great have on your desk type of item. This is also a unicorn, but this unicorn is not sitting uh, in a crescent. Uh, this unicorn's just bobbing around here on some green fluid. Uh-huh. <laughs> And now it's being shaken around. 
and you can turn it like this. Now, parents, you're probably wondering, how safe is this? So these are for ages six and up, and this plastic is not like a shattery plastic. It's a very rubbery plastic. So, you know, while I would not suggest, and this is to kitty, this is a cute little kid face to camera. Come on. This is a little kitty just floating along in a sea of gold and white tranquility. See, and that's just really relaxing to me, too. I mean, there's the shaking it up part of it, you know, but then there's just sort of this like having this sit on my desk and they do have a flat bottom so they will sit so you could just sort of you know sit it on your desk and it's just like there in front of you while you're on calls you can kind of bang into it a little bit and play this one is I guess it's a dolphin it's a dolphin who looks like he's dressed like Donald Duck though a little bit and of course in a sea of blue Whoa! Look at that. You can just, and you can get them to go, you would go like this, and you get it to spin. Whoa! And that is really what life feels like. This is, also looks like a pink dolphin to me. I, they're all dolphins, right? I'm like, but it's not a dolphin. It's a fish. Ooh, that one's pretty. Look at how cute that is. And then this is, what are you? Oh, this is a narwhal. Oh my gosh, I just realized it's a narwhal. So, like, how old were you when you found out that narwhals were real? I was about 50. <laughs> I was 50 years old when I figured out that a narwhal was not like a unicorn and that it is not a mythical creature. What are you? This is, I can't, what is it, Axtel, Axtelly Act? I cannot say. But he is so cute because he's doing a, come on, turn around. Face the camera. Are you camera shy? I am. Come on, turn around. He is doing an excellent job of floating on top because his tail is so long. So this is that adorable little reptile that is also one of those things that you're like, that's not real, right? That's not a real animal. And then you're like, get out, that exists. Yeah, they're all over Mexico, Melissa. They're real. Get out. So cute. Look at you, there's your cute face. See, look how cute I am. And these are much cuter in person. What are you? I'm not really sure. Oh, I think, mm, no. Uh, what do you guys think that is? I do not know. I have no idea. Woo! But it's really cute and pink. Ugh! 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 2021! Ugh! <laughs> and who have we got over here? Uh, oh, this is a white cat. It's a white cat in some pink with gold and you see how they just bob along like even if you're not shaking the snot out of them they're still really really fun and i think like from an adult perspective this is a shark it's a shark in blue da -da, da -da. wait i'm trying to get them to see your teeth really melissa yes really and what are you you uh this is another narwhal and this one is in purple. Ooh. And let's see, I'm getting tired. My arms are getting tired from shaking. And what are you? This might be, it's carrying something. I think it's carrying a strawberry. Look at the way they just bob along. Like just bobbing along in life. Just, just hanging out, just hanging out in my egg bobbing along. I mean, look at how relaxing that is. Like the lights are kind of reflecting on it. So you're not getting the best view, but look at how relaxing that is. Don't you kind of wish you were just bobbing along on a sea of stars and green something. And it looks like it's holding a strawberry. I don't know. The dark ones are really cool. This one's got like a purple shark in it. And then it's got this deep blue with dark blue stars or sort of turquoisey stars. Very cool. These look really, really cool. Whoa. And then it's like, boop, you know, then there's this bright colored thing. And our last one is a clown fish. There you go. Guys, it's a clown fish. Might be my favorite just because of the humor of the whole thing. And it's yellow. So probably this one's gonna stay on my desk and maybe the thing I can't 
know how to, I don't know how to say, cause, cause they're so cute. Now, now, these are the ones that you know what you're getting, okay? You know what they need to do? They need to make a Roblox game with these. You're like, what woman? I think everything needs a Roblox game nowadays. I'm just like, I started playing Roblox, now I can't stop. So series one also comes in blind baggies. They're called prize baggies. So you know when you go to the carnival and they have the, uh, the, 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 the little tiny fish bowls and you're like supposed to like throw money or something in them. When I was a kid, they don't do it anymore. When I was a kid, they used to put food coloring in that water. So these poor goldfish were swimming in different colored water. That was probably why the goldfish died soon after you brought it home. But these will not die soon after you bring them home. So they are blind packaged. Uh, this is series one and there are 12 of them to collect. Same thing, you get them wherever you get your blind bags and stuff. Now, okay, this is a very, to me, like I said, this is very retro to me because I can't tell you how many <laughs> goldfish we had that bit the dust soon after getting one of these and bringing it home at a carnival. But not not a tsunamis necessarily, but getting a, uh, a, a you know, a fishy in a bag. Are you ready? You're going to love this. You're going to love it. I probably can't bring it on the airplane because it's got, you're like, you're going on an airplane? I'm going on an airplane. I'm leaving New Jersey in two days. I'm so freaked out. Well, that's good. I did all that and I ripped it open anyway. Okay, this is my first Tsunami's blind. Oh, I got the white kitty cat. Are you gonna die? Are you ready? It's a keychain with a little plastic bag. It's made out of the same kind of really thick rubbery plastic as the eggs, but it's a Tsunami. So it's got a little white cat inside and but think about this, like hanging off a backpack, hanging off your purse, your laptop bag. Like I have lots of very immature things that hang off of my bags. Um, this is such a cute idea to have them in these little bags. So the other thing is, is just from a perspective of collecting, you could like hang them up, like if you collect them, you could string them, you know, somewhere in your room or your office or whatever, and then just kind of walk by and da -da 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 -da. you can hang them off command hooks. So cute. All right, let's open another one. Let's see what else we got here. Hmm, let's see who else. So they said 12 to collect. Um, oh, I could just have opened it from the bottom. Mm -hmm. Live and learn. And again, ages six and up parents, so. Oh, 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 oh! <laughs> I got the thing whose name I can't say, and it comes in pink. <gasps> so I got the Axtoli thing, and it's in a little plastic baggy of adorable pink with silver stars. Oh my gosh, look at how cute that is. That is adorable. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. Oh yeah, like I said, I probably, I probably wouldn't get away with bringing that on the plane. Probably more than three ounces of liquid in here. I don't know. I don't know, but I wouldn't try it. You will probably get in big trouble, and you won't be able to get on a plane, and you won't be able to see your friends, and it would suck. It would totally suck. I mean, look at this. This concept, whoever thought of this, of like, so we've got the tsunamis, which is a great concept, and then somebody's like, <gasps> what if we made plastic bags that look? Like, it even has a little bow on it. What if we made plastic bags that looked like when you win the fish at the carnival or when you bring the fish home from, you know, the pet store. Let's do one more, one more Tsunami's surprise. It's prize baggies, they're called. Prize baggy. Um, and these, I guess, are around the same price somewhere, you know, between five, six, seven dollars. I, I don't know. Um, they didn't send me, oh, they didn't send me any particular. This looks like a chameleon with a cup of coffee. Are you a chameleon with, oh my gosh. No, it's a narwhal. I think it's a narwhal. What do you think? Wait, come on, turn around, face everybody. Okay, what do we think? Narwhal with a cup of coffee. Oh, it's bubble tea. It's, I think it's a narwhal with a boba, right? Is that what that is? 
I think that's what that is. That's your booty. Oh, that's cute. <gasps> so cute. And look, she's got a little pink bow. These figures are adorable. They need to make these figures as Squishmallows and then they need to make these figures into a Roblox game. So I would like to say a huge, huge, huge thank you to uh, the folks at UCC Distributing for sending me all of those Squishmallows and all of these tsunamis, which are, you know, a little bit hard to find, but it's fun to have something so and unique and different in terms of small collectibles. You know, it's been a while since we had something that was like, oh, you know what? That's actually worth collecting. And I think from an adult perspective, it's actually something that adults could really enjoy from a sensory relaxation perspective because it's got that like snow globe, but cutesy vibe, but you know, I really think they're cool. So let me know if you started uh, finding tsunamis, if you think they're cool, if you're obsessed with tsunamis videos on TikTok and uh, what you think of them. And also if you have a favorite Squishmallow, I mean, I'm not saying that Tito's my fave. I'm not, but I'm keeping him. He's mine. Mm. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I love you so much, and I will see you again real soon. Bye.